So this knowledge is, is about um, the body, right? The body and the way the body processes waste, right? Waste products and uh, rids itself of waste products, right? And this is um, quite an interesting uh, subject because you have this uh, idea right, built into the sort of uh, the, the fabricated history of sort of medicine and their uh, healing and all this, right? which is a, an idea that they used to draw the blood from the sort of external body. So make a cut on the outside of the body, right? on the uh, veins and that, to draw blood out of the body and uh, draw poison out of the out of the body, right? For the functioning of the system and all that, right? And to me, right, um, it seems a bit, uh, seems like it could have been totally fabricated, that idea. I didn't, I didn't think how it would fly in reality, like, you know what I mean? But it seems based on <coughs> uh, taking the idea of the internal systems, right? Because when you have your internal systems of like stomach and uh, veins and blood uh, circulation and all that, right? that internal system basically flushes poison out via a natural uh, means, right? So basically, if you have like, um, see a pain in your foot or leg, right? This basically can't be remedied by a good excretion, right? Yeah, because the sort of, you know, the the air, uh, the, the the way that the body system works, right? The the air, uh, the gut, the belly, the stomach, right? Is a very uh, clever organ, right? <clears throat> this is why in the sort of uh, the Chinese uh, medicine, right? The sort of view the uh, the mind as basically the belly is included in the mind. The sort of the the, the way to view the belly and stomach, right? Is more to do with the mind than the actual brain, right? Whereas obviously in the sort of Western medicine, as they call it. The, the, uh, the belly and the gut and the stomach and that is now to do with the, the mind. The mind is all to do with the brain, right? So they're obviously, you know, uh, fiddling around with the knowledges there, you see what I'm saying? <coughs> cutting out the sort of, um, cutting out the vital systems, right? From your sort of, uh, your uh, knowledge of what it's about, right? And this is the way this sort of body, the body system works as a whole. So you have like the idea of holistic medicine and all that, where the whole body's working together, you see, to, to, to uh, create health in that, right? And obviously you have um, ideas like cancer, right? Where cancer is basically a death program, right? Because cancer is like, uh, you've got the cane idea, right? It's like the curse of cane, right? The cancer. And any, any type of... Um, any type of sort of malfunction in your body, right? And you can't, and you go to a, you know, like a Western medicine uh, specialist or whatever, you get a diagnosis of cancer, right? You could have the pain in your, you know, in your hand, your sort of upper regions, your, you know, your foot, wherever, right? And it would come back as a sort of diagnosis, right? If you was to consult one of these type Western medicine people, right? It would be, uh, given back as a diagnosis of cancer, right? no matter what the pain was or, or what, right? <clears throat> so it's like, a, you know, it's like a sort of a, a death program, it's like a blanket, um, blanket description, right? cancer, right? And of course within that, right, it's like that old uh, D.F. Johnson video what he done about concern. It's like the concern, you see. Yeah, the one, like, they want to sort of, when these people are doing brainwashing against you, right? They want to concern you with their problems, right? not your sort of own real problems to be dealt with, right? which can be dealt with. But they want to concern you with the, their version of reality, you see what I'm saying? So it's always their problem which they want to concern you with. But in, in, in reality, it's like you've got your own problem and you want to sort of be concerned with your own problem and dealing with it in effective uh, capacity, you see what I'm saying? So it's always the con and the can, yeah, always to deal with these ideas, right? And so, um, that idea of the bloodletting, right, um, seems to me to be an externalization, right, of the true workings of the body, right, uh, which is the internal sort of organs. And these, and these basically, like I say, the air, uh, these draw poison, right, and then basically excrete it through the, um, you know, bowels and stomach and all that, the waste, the waste products, right? Um, that sort of, you know, is it, when working properly, see, will draw poison and eliminate poison out of the body, see. 
So the sort of, sort of wish to uh, you know, confuse the idea of that because that'll make you sick and basically make you ill if you get all confused in your sort of body workings. So that, that would seem to me to be the idea of that external blood lint, right, which is a famous historical idea, you see. And like I say, I can't see that anyone would have practiced that. I mean, you know, it's basically a ridiculous idea. It's not going to, uh, you know what I mean? You're not going to open up your veins on the outside to sort of draw poison, you know what I mean? Because basically you can achieve the same ends as that via going to the toilet, you know what I'm saying? It's like pretty simple, isn't it, really? And um, sort of this this comes to the idea of the food, right? So you have to air the food. Obviously, the, <coughs> the created all processed sort of snack foods and um, <coughs> ready ready meals and all that, right? which is obviously laden with uh, chemicals and, and crap, right? <coughs> which has the sort of effect of constipating your um, your waste elimination sort of um, system, see what I'm saying? <coughs> which seems to be the, the sort of main reason for why they created it, basically, you know what I mean? Like the sort of uh, the poison idea, right? And um, I, was, I, was, I was interested to see something on the TV screen, like uh, they, they made these programs about big fat people and all this, right? Obviously these sort of teas and that were like, you know, great big and fat and all that and uh, an interesting little fact that come about from that was sort of these people only go at the toilet right like uh, there was one that was like every three weeks or something right like the, you know and now they could be putting cords in with that type of stuff but um you know it, like you know they didn't, they didn't even go at the toilet you know sit down and have an excretion right for like three weeks right which is a uh, you know you know, it says a lot, doesn't it? That we're getting to that sort of size, right? You're getting, you're getting your sort of body into such a state as that, right? And you're not even sort of using the sort of the elimination system of the sort of body which is there for that reason, right? To sort of eliminate poisons, ensure the working of the body and that, and then the sort of get to that size where you know it sort of makes perfect sense, doesn't it? Because obviously a healthy person or whatever, relatively healthy, is, is a excreting, you know, at least once a day, you know what I'm saying? To uh, eliminate the poisons, right? And uh, so that would seem to be uh, correlating to this idea of the external blood lint, right? which uh, seems to me to be, an, again, another sort of fabricated, scripted piece of uh, supposed historical background, you see what I'm saying? Now the idea also of the leeches using leeches and all this, which is, again, you know, it's pretty ridiculous, you know what I mean? Put a leech on you, and that's like, you know what I mean? It's like, yeah, it doesn't seem to be very realistic, you know. So, uh, <clears throat> that would seem to be what that's about. Um, so, if, if, if you look in the sort of the Eastern the eastern medicines, right, the sort of view that uh, the, the whole sort of body is working as one, you see, to, for the health of the um, for health of the system, right, the health of the being. And then the sort of West and the sort of air uh, divided, you know. It's like, you know, this sort of idea that the brain is separate from the other organs and all that. But of course, these organs are all sort of designed to work with one another, you see what I'm saying? And they all sort of play their part in that, you see what I'm saying? So it's like a holistic system, i.e., working as a whole, you know what I mean? So it seems to be what it's about. Yeah. The course, the pills, the pills, what they sort of uh, prescribe you through this um, like Western medicine system, are basically you know useless. They're not healing pills whatsoever. They all seem to be um, uh, taken from the halogen group, right? The halogen group of chemicals. Right? <coughs> the course, like remember here, that sort of uh, chemicals that can have three states, like um, gas solid and uh, liquid right so you can basically take a chemical of any type and put, and put it into one of these states right um, and there uh, you get any type of pills through this western medicine right whether it's like um like prozac what do you call it antidepressant pills right or the type of uh, painkillers or things like that right they seem to all be based off this halogen group of chemicals right which is basically the same as like uh, Fluorine, right? Fluorine is one of them. In uh, rat poison, right? So when you have rat poison, right? Rat poison is basically just a, a sedative type of thing, right? You put it down, and the rat basically eats the poison and basically you know, sedates 
to a point where it just sort of falls asleep and just dies. See what I'm saying? Because the sort of large dosage is <coughs> and that seems to be the same, <coughs> same stuff, right? Is what is in these pills, right? It's like a sedative. So you know, it's prescribed there. Uh, these pills is you know uh, to alleviate, see, uh, and levitate, right? Them type of ideas together. So like a spirit, uh, the spirit of the person sort of goes up or down, right? When taking these type of uh, pills and that, see what I'm saying? And that's all it seems to be. So there's no sort of real healing within them pills. What they prescribe, it's basically sedative, mood changing type of uh, chemicals, right? So, you know, useless basically, see what I'm saying? So it's not a day with healing, right? It's just a day with um, sedation, you see what I'm saying? Um, so you have them type of ideas there, right? So uh, obviously the sort of Western medicine system is, you know, uh, is not about healing people of uh, illness and all that, you see what I mean? It's just about um, prolonging it basically, you know what I mean? Because the illness is is useful to the air uh, you know the system and the sort of people who run the system it's sort of good for them to have ill people and all that you see what i'm saying <coughs>